Shalom family, it's your sister again, Sister Ray about Yehuda Thomas, here today to talk to you guys about the month of May. So I know you guys are probably like, girl, the month of May is almost over. I know, it is almost over. I've been super busy, but the month of May is not over yet. So since almost doesn't count, here's this video. So the month of May, if you guys are not aware, is Prater Willy Syndrome Awareness Month. Now I know you guys probably are like, Raya, what is Prater Willy Syndrome? Prader Willi syndrome, I'm going to explain. So, Prader Willi syndrome is a genetic disorder. It affects um, the father's copy of chromosome 15. Um, in most cases, uh, well, not most cases, in some cases, it's a uh, what's called a deletion, which means, though, of course, it's connotation. <laughs> it, the father's copy is not there. The father's copy of chromosome 15 is not there. And then in other cases, uh, the child has what's called a translocation, or person has a translocation of the father's copy of chromosome 15, which in this case is how it is in this particular situation. So, Prater Willis Syndrome Awareness Month is very near and dear to our hearts because my daughter, Ruby Jane, our daughter, Ruby Jane, uh, has Prater Willis Syndrome. She was diagnosed uh, when she was about a week, maybe a week and a half old, and um, we've honestly been through quite a bit over the course of her life thus far but we give all praise to the most high because he does all things well he makes no mistakes we know that um all things always work for our good because we live our lives according to the scripts and the commandments the laws and the statutes of the most high and we work uh diligently to keep those and we know that um anything that happens whether it be just uh as a lesson to the world to show the greatness and the uh, majesty of the Most High, or if it's righteous judgment, um, we give praise in all things because they always work out for us. So anyway, like I said, I just wanted to come to you guys to talk to you all about the month of May. Um, as the month continues on, I'm going to talk more. I know I need to do more audience engagement. I do need to engage you guys more. I love you guys for just really clicking on my TikToks even to to see anything, to get any kind of, I don't know, to see what I'm doing or get any kind of information or whatever it is. But like I said, this month, it'll be a lot more engagement because I do want to bring a lot more awareness um, to Prader Willis Syndrome. Um, the the awareness or the Prader Willis Syndrome Awareness Month color is orange. Uh, the last uh, Friday of the month is like go orange for Prada Willis Syndrome Awareness Month. So I'm asking that all of you guys on my TikTok, if you would go orange on the very last, if you can remember, if it's not too much to ask, I don't know, you know, I don't want to put you guys out or anything, but the last month of the last Friday of this month, if you guys would go orange and maybe do like a video or just, you know, it does. You don't have to really say anything. You can just hashtag that you're going orange. You can at me and that would be amazing. And I'll be able to put that compilation together and um, I'll be happy to put that on um, on all of my social network platforms. So on YouTube as well as on TikTok and on um with like Facebook and Snapchat. But like I said, this month I'll be doing a lot more content on um, Prader Willis Syndrome because this is Prader Willis Syndrome we're in this month. It is near and dear to our hearts. And um, like I said, it'll be like another like official introduction to um, Ruby Jane, our daughter who has Prader Willis Syndrome. And uh, we'll talk more about um, living not just with Prader Willis Syndrome, but just mothers and families dealing with I don't want to say dealing with but mothers and families who are living and existing um, with children or family members with special needs and what that means and sometimes all we need is a support group and sometimes our support group is virtual and sometimes it's our sisters and sometimes it's our brothers and our aunties and our uncles that are afar so I love family, I love coming together, I love the support, and I know what it's like to be a new mommy and have a brand new baby, and you've not even healed up yet, or you're not even done bleeding yet, and somebody's coming to you telling you what it is that, you know, 
your child is going to be and what you can expect. So I know what that's like. So I'm here for y'all. I love y'all so much. Talk to you soon. Shalom.